How's it going, gents? Here we are today on the MotoGP run. There's Brendog's uh, WR250R. Got a couple of lads out. Another year. Pretty early in the morning right now. Gonna get up there, camp at night, and uh, watch Mark Marquez destroy them tomorrow at the race. My wife is here. Unexpectedly rocked up on her 636. Pissing out fuel. Just another one of the many problems. Everything's coming out of, of buying an MV Augusta. It gets nervous. Uh, do you ever ride the thing and something doesn't go wrong with it? No, no. We are all getting red to go. My freaking tank bag is full of freaking sleeping bags. It looks all weird. Let's go to Cranburn, gents. Where's my waifu? ZXR, that's a good number plate. Envy Augusta Riviale! Pissing out petrol. Still very slow and safe ride to Cranbourne now, I'm in D mode, wheelie control is on, um, I'm dicking around, so many police officers out, so gents, we, I am camping at the MotoGP again because it was the best thing ever, uh, this time with my wife, but it was very last minute, I actually don't have any camping gear for her. <laughs> So I think she's just going to take my camping gear and I'm just going to get drunk and sleep on the grass at Phillip Island when it's like 9 degrees, so. I think this is one of the uh, one of the best things about having like chassis control or wheelie control that's like set to your map and you can't change it while you're riding is it stops you from doing silly stuff. Like there's so much of me that makes, makes you want to do wheelies right now because I'm like riding in a big group of people and shit, but I literally can't. I have to stop to be able to change the map, to be able to turn off wheelie control. Hey look, I go down to first gear and freaking give it a... Just got a pogo like that and wheelie control. It freaking won't do it, man. So stupid. I'm gonna slowly let everyone come past, so... Old mate. Old mate, old mate Bill. Envy Augusta, is that a sprag clutch that's exploded? WR, the humble WR. Double SLs and double Rs. MTR1. The humble Daytona. 1190. Ah, hit him 690. Pina wheels, 390. Looks like another old WR. MT. Ah, oh, coppers. And a street speed speed trip. Highway patrol. That's why we're not doing any wheelies today. And and my wife won a 636. A camping gear we've got for two people. My wife's got a backpack which has no camping gear in it. I've got my tank bag which has just got a sleeping bag. And I've got a backpack on which has got the tent. One mattress. I can either go to Kmart and buy some really cheap shitty uh, camping gear or I can do the Russian approach and just get really drunk and just sleep on the ground. And the amount of alcohol in my body will help me survive. I've seen Russians do it before. Much colder there than it is Phillip Island, so uh, I might survive. A little impromptu stop. Had to get some uh, Petronas. Is that a new freaking Raptor? That is. That's the first Ranger Raptor I've seen. Whoa! Ford. Ranger Raptor. There's two of them in there. First one I've seen, man. I really want one. We don't get F-150s in Australia, but we have um, a much smaller version called the Ranger of like a 150. Um, it's just a shitty little two-liter diesel, but um, 
It actually looks like it's quite fast, the new Ranger Raptor, and you can like jump it and stuff. It's pretty cool. And the ads that do it jumps and stuff. Because so many people need a car to do off-road jumps. I love it. All right, gents, here we are. Another year on a different motorcycle. Every freaking year on a different freaking motorcycle. One of these years, I will have the same motorcycle. I, I think I'll be on a different motorcycle next freaking year as well. Jesus Christ, but here we are, MotoGP run here at Cranbourne. I'm a bit sad this year because my dad's not here. He's um been a bit unwell. Uh, had some a couple little issues with his leg. And then um one of the smart doctors went to a few doctors and they're like, oh, you're just old, you got a sore leg. And he finally went to a smart doctor and noticed that his whole left side was um kind of wigging out on him. They found that his spine was getting slowly crushed by something. So he had to get surgery on his spine. He is recovering though. Hopefully he'll be here next year. That's the new BMW Highway Patrol car. Well, you can take my license a bit later on. No, I'm doing the right thing today. Here we are, gents. I'm not usually this far back. Here's wifey. She made it. There we go. 5,000 motorcycle riders about to um, head down to Phillip Island. Pretty freaking cool, man. I'm gonna go find a sleeping bag for my wife so we don't freeze tonight. Kmart's just over there. We're just strapping uh, very quickly purchased camping gear Fantastic. for the well, Humble you, WR. Thanks for the yeah. dogs. No, no workers, mate. No yeah. strap on there, please. Wifey's ready to go on a little 636 MT10 SP. Ready to go. There's a 959 Corsa over there. It's a nice looking bike. Let's freaking go, eh? Gonna be lots of uh, lots of revving, lots of tooting on. Actually, I haven't tested it. This is usually the first time I use the horn on a new motorcycle, is the uh, MotoGP run. I usually have never used it, and then I'll use it for that MotoGP run, and then I'll buy another freaking motorbike. So I'm always on a goddamn new motorbike. Coming in. Arch Barker up in the uh, in the cherry picker. Hey Arch Barker. Ah, someone's lost their glove already. We're a bit late to get flags this year. Not that the flags never really lasted longer than about here. This is when you would generally lose them. Let's test out the old horn, eh? Where is the horn on this bike? Always oh, sounds goofy as. A cruise control this year. Yay! I can do double-handed waving. Cruise control, double-handed waving, and dabs, dabs. Oh, look at the big freaking horse dog! Hey, buddy. I'm on a finally. I'm on a freaking comfortable motorcycle. Every freaking year, I'm on some silly sports bike. This year, I'm riding comfort. Got my comfort seat. Got my cruise control. She's keen on the Grom. Grom all the way to Phillip Island. Brendan, have it up for the camera. Come on, do a jump. Do a wheelie or a jump. Do something cool. Come on, Brendan. Yes. Summertime in Australia, so Americans, you can suck it. Enjoy your wintry icy tundra. Summertime for us Aussies. The 990, what a beast. I hope the new 790 makes it as good as the 990. Yo man, i 690. Come on. Floppy boobs, she got them out. Jesus Christ. I think I might have missed it on the camera, but she's still there, gents. She's still there. Every bloody year. There you go, coming in for the kids. <laughs> Jesus. Coming in for the high fives. Coming in for the high fives. Coming in, coming in. Ah. the bridge to Phillip Island. Go straight to the track, set up camp, base camp, and 
and uh, get ready for a freaking awesome day of qualifying. Tomorrow's the race. All right, Jen's just setting up our little campsite. We've got MotoGP out there right now. Yeah, mate, on yet. the tinnies, yeah, just, uh, on the tinnies, just coke, yeah, I swear, yeah, just coke. Yeah, yeah, yeah just coke, yeah, totally yeah. just coke. So this is the MotoGP Dimitri, oh, freak. I'm drunk <laughs> already from the coke, one mate. drink. It's, uh, this is the MotoGP track. It's a lot, uh, it's a lot uh, smaller than you yeah, thought. Yeah, I know, it's a bit orange thing. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Mark Ez was just coming around before we I came around here. Uh, had to dodge the scale. barrier and stuff. And this is a one-man tent. One man it's tent. very skinny, it's one person wide, so Tom's going to see if he can get in the old vestibule, but uh, <laughs> you might have to wear your helmet or not. <laughs> Some pictures of the bikes with the sunset. We're set up. We've got our tents, got our little fire going. Check about, it to out, get a, mate. about to get a palmer. Hey, brother. It's nice and warm. Nice warm little fire. Warrior Luigi over there. The uh, Phillip Island racetrack just over there. Yeah, Massive tent the that I get to sleep in with my wife. She's going to be sleeping on top of me because this is a one man tent. It's only that wide, so <laughs> it's not made for two people, but. <laughs> I'd say it's sort it out. We'll one. sort it out. Yeah. Do another one. Do a sick cut, you burn out. What the freak, man? Fireworks! Yeah, definitely some regulation fireworks, eh, Tom? Oh, yeah, definitely yeah, regulation. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Great trying to sleep tonight, eh? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Bloody till 5am they'll be doing this shit. Bloody cabin to the GP, mate. What a, what a bloody... So rowdy. So rowdy. So rowdy. So rowdy. Love it. Bed people got a big day tomorrow. Ready for race day. Chasing the peacock. And, um, scaring the peacock. No noise. It's kind of weird to listen to. 